There we go. So that will account for all our notifications going out. I know I have a I've, I found a cool way I could put up a post on Tumblr that will put up a post on everyone's timeline who follows me or who is following that tag and runs into me where they will see the actual live stream video of me as I'm live, which is cool. This game supports an auto save feature. Please don't turn off your game when you see the auto. You, when the I don't even notice when the auto save feature comes on. It comes and goes so fast that I don't even notice. Okay. Okay. All right. So we got our big ad out the way. And it's kind of funny how be, like the way this is branded. Beyond Good and Evil, uh, Ubisoft Original. I mean, for arguably for tw the last nine, tw literal 20 years, Ubisoft has basically tried to do as much as they could to pretend this game didn't exist. Alright. So we, uh, we completed the Ancient Mind Dungeon. We were sent in to take a, f a photographic evidence of an alien creature that was hiding in the mine. And a pair of alien creatures, little worms. And it turns out that those two little worms were actually the eyes of a gigantic serpent that we had to fight. And after that fight, we got uh, access to the secret hideout of the Iris Network that the government propaganda says is a terrorist group that's uh, helping the Dom's alien invaders uh, take over the planet. But it turns out that the Iris Network is actually a resistance movement that uh, is exposing the corruption of the private army that was sent in in order to protect us from these aliens. So... Those... Th this, this is a holographic projection of the game world. And we have to go to there. That is the Nutripil's food factory. And then we have to go to the slaughterhouse. And then we have to uh, go to the base on the moon. Because we have to expose this human trafficking conspiracy. That's being... Uh... Well, actually, let's... Uh, for those who are not here, why don't we... Why don't we open this up and get a primer on what's going on. Freedom Operation. The Alpha Sections have deceived us. Since the beginning of the war, they have been controlled by the Dom. Oh, oops, The Alpha oops, Sections oops, have oh, deceived oh. us. Since the beginning of the war, they have been controlled by the Doms and profit from the general chaos to kidnap innocent people. Wow. Thanks to Double H, we now know where the victims are No relation are to me, mind you. One, the Nutripills factory. Two, the old slaughterhouse in the shuttles. Three, the moon in a cargo cruiser. We must put an end to this nightmare. Every proof we can find relating to this conspiracy will bring us more and more support from the people. A general uprising would allow us to overthrow the Alpha Sections and save thousands of innocent lives. If the revolt spreads, we may be able to end this war. But we need photographic evidence. I mean, to find it out sounds exactly like the replacement of one war with another, but I would still consider it progress in this situation. Without their helmets on, to know who they really are. All right, so we've got to go to the factory to get photos of the victims, photos of the Alpha Sections without their helmets That's on. That's where you come in, Jade. You take over Double H's mission. Here's his last report. All right. Ship's log, Double H. 1923. I am in the Forbidden Zone. 1930. I can see the shuttles coming and going from the upper platform. 2003. I have succeeded in penetrating into the factory. 2050. I'm exhausted. I must have swam almost two miles. 2110. I'm inside. That's it. I can see the black cases. A noise. Hey, are those the... how they're transporting the people they capture? Apparently, they've trained a reaper. 
The presence of this animal along with the Sigma rays are the proof of the presence of a spirit eater. Hmm. These are his last shots. We've had nothing else for the last four days. Radio silence. Double H was our best reporter. He's done a lot for us. Thanks to him, the Iris Network was he able to get in contact with the governor of From Hillis. the front, he looks a little bit like... The governor is radically opposed to the Alpha sections and their methods, but she must not be found out. She's willing to help us if, on our side, we let the truth be known, and if more and more Hillians trust the Iris Network. If you find a door like this one, photograph it and send the picture to the governor. Her team of experts will try to find the code. We're counting on you, Jade. Be careful. Han. If you find it, we're counting on you, Jake. Okay. All right, now we've got our uh, refresh and what exactly we're supposed to be doing. So why don't we... Yeah, I think she, the cat girl here, makes the newspaper. This uh, engineer dude uh, actually publishes it. Or, uh, so got our little resistance base here. It's an alright base. It would be nice if they had some supplies they could hand out, maybe gratis. We do get a free copy of the Iris Network's uh, underground newspaper, though. Let's uh, play... Let's play the sh shell game a bit. I forgot. I guess after a certain point, this game becomes... Uh, for entertainment purposes only. Because I got several thousand... I got several thousand dollars out of this. I guess they decided it was, uh... Hey, there... There's Paige. There's our... Our adopted uncle. Yeah, South Gate. A giant crowbar for 300... <laughs> That's a good way to describe it. A giant crowbar for 300 needle, me, 300 meter. Th the giant crowbar for 300 meter nails. Okay. All right. So uh, we should have access to new parts of the city now, like this. We need a special key. Okay, not the triangle one, but I think we got a uh, citizen's card or something that they called it, so we could access some. Parts of the town that were off limits previous, previously. So we don't want to spend all our money there. We'll explore that before we go off to the, uh, to do the, see about infiltrating the factory. Alright, so I gotta go. And that's the district headquarters of the, uh, I almost said the Magisterium. No, not the Magisterium, the Alpha sections. There's the sexist dude. Okay, so what? I'm like a little scrambled up. Like, okay. I felt like I was very easy to find that section back when I uh, didn't have the city pass. And now that I actually need to go there, I'm just stumbling around. Alright, that's the way to the bar. Oh, and by the way, this, uh, this propaganda video with this evil, like, general in black armor with skulls on it, uh, this guy is supposed to be in charge of the army that's come in to protect us from the evil alien invaders. They look like the evil invaders. Um, they call this game Beyond Good and Evil, which I know is sort of is rooted in uh, Nietzschean philosophy. And there's a lot of ambiguity, like, oh, who's telling the truth? Can we trust the Iris Network? Can we trust... Are the Alpha Sections actually helping us? There's really no ambiguity. And this is not a spoiler. There's abs there's zero ambiguity. This is flat out, like, it's very explicit. Is your intensive recruitment campaign playing off, paying off? Sorry, Shortcake, but I'm on duty by the... Pa oh, good gravy. Why can't we go anywhere we want on Hillis anymore? Citizen Protection, Carlson and Peters, Volume 5. Yeah, that sounds like a military manual. Now let's go, so these guys, these guys here, these aren't alpha sections, these are actual Hillian soldiers. 
the alpha section sort of just showed up out of nowhere. So what is in here? Transit. Huh. Okay. Protected district is what they call it. They let everything go to the dogs. In any case, there's a passage. We can sneak through. For what purpose? Huh. Okay, so I have to... There's something going on over there. I'm gonna go have a look. Um... Hey there. Okay. Oh. I forgot which button is to... Okay, it's the B button is to dive, okay. So I gotta dive over that. Okay. Wow. Look at look at all this. Defense secret, low level biological activity. Huh. Yeah, um, so like I said, I have not actually played this game in 20 years, so this is genuinely new to me. Alright, fortunately they give you these little, uh, platforms. Okay, so Z, R... Can you only run at specified moments, though? Alright. So I'm going the right way so far. Yeah, this isn't even the main quest. This is just from some little side area. This looks major enough to be a main quest point. Oh yeah, they're very generous with these, okay. Oh, okay. Sure. No! Oh my goodness. How did I dodge that? That was amazing, that I actually dodged the barrel. Huh. Okay. I thought my phone was vibrating a second on my desk. It was just the neighbor's music. It worth it to eat. Okay. Oh my goodness. Oh, doggone. Like, the controls? Uh, maybe I'm just, maybe it's because, maybe I'm just getting too old. Maybe I'm getting too old for this. I got something about. You know, I'll come. I want to. I'll come back here once I get more used to the controls again, maybe. Oh. I can't... Okay, I'm... 
Yeah, it looks like I'm committed to this gauntlet of uh, conveyor belts. You can't just exit now. Alright, yeah, something about the fact that to dive is the R bumper. What? 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 Oh, are you kidding me? Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, no. The dive is... B! Oh, I, I keep thinking it's... I don't know why I thought it was X. I don't know why I thought it was X. Okay, and it's not... Okay. It's the R... It's ZL. The du duck. So ZL the duck. Okay. Keep forgetting. Yes, I can. Okay. So we get B to dive. Huh. ZL to duck. ZL to duck. And B to dive. Okay, we, we did it again. Okay, cool. ZL to duck. And B to dive. Now, there are multiple belts I could take here. No, no, that's a, that would just take me back to ZL to duck. B to dive, ZL to duck, B to dive, okay. So this is where I think I died last time. So, huh? Okay, so now let's take a look at what's around here. supposed to grab onto the device, that, uh, container. Alright. So where am I supposed to, am I, unless I'm just supposed to fall into that next belt? I mean, thank goodness this is a video game where I can trust that there's actually a destination in mind that they intend me to go. Unless I'm just supposed to make my way past all these platforms. Yeah, because I don't think I've been over here yet. So if I... Okay, yeah. Yeah, I, I'm supposed to be going that way. Okay, I get it now. I get it. Now I have to deal with... CL2, comma. They gotcha, gotcha. Okay, we get it. We got it. We got it. We're safe. Okay. Hold on. I don't know why this is happening. Uh, I'm gonna have to step off camera for a minute. Hold on.
Okay. Hey, everybody, I'm back. Um, for whatever reason, now I'm not going to, um, you could disregard the timer. I don't know why. Um, for the first time since last week, while I was streaming, I came, like, I guess about 70% of the way to, uh, getting sick in the toilet. So I had to run over to the bathroom. Last time I came about 95% of the way. But, uh, hold on. I, okay, I just belched a bit. I feel a tad better now. Okay. Uh, I have no clue why this is happening. But I feel a little better now. Okay, I feel a lot better. I guess I just had to belch. And if I ever do get sick, um, if I have to, if I did actually get sick, I would have, uh, ended the stream there. Which would have been... Oh my... Okay. Whew! Whew, okay. I... Okay, okay. Okay, we can, we can kick with A. I can't take it. It's not like I keep trying to play this like it's Zelda, where I could just take out my sword whenever I want and smash uh, pots or grass. But you can only take out your sword during combat scenes. Okay, can I? I don't even know what they're doing here. I don't even know what I'm doing here. I guess I'm hoping. Like all that crazy fire and brimstone stuff down there. And then over here you just have some standard, you know, contemporary. Oh, nice. A pearl. A pearl. Oh, we want this. Okay. Taken back from the alpha sections. Nice. We have six pearls currently. Is there anything? All right, nothing up there. Ah. There was some kind of weird traffic going on with some cases, and a pearl. Okay. All right, that was worth it. And uh, we definitely memorize controls. X is to dive. No, X is to dive. And ZL is to crouch. You'll remember that now because I had to say it out loud to remind myself a bunch of times. What are these flowers for? Who is in here? What is in here? Oh, Mingzu shop. We heard about this place. Jade, a new outfit for Jade. A dia... A camera. A di is that a different camera? A better camera with a better zoom? I forget... You know what? I want to go save and then check out what the, some of those... It looks like there were some... Uh, maybe potentially cosmetic purchases... Uh Okay, uh We have an auto save here. Nori it's from your Nori shop. We're gonna go back into I think you have to go from here I think you have to I have to go all the way to the Akuda bar. And between the Akuda bar and Ming Zhu's shop, it seems like and then there it seems like there are fairly few businesses in this town, the only town in our inhabited area of the planet, that are not in some way involved in the resistance. Alright. Let's save here. Let's make a... Okay. Saving content. 
monsters. So let's now we can go back to that shop. Hopefully we don't buy anything. Everything we get is cool. I think if that was a custom outfit, I believe it was a custom outfit that was specifically based upon, I guess, what you could, uh, some of the early concept art for Jade, uh, which I did check out. Uh, I have been blogging a few Beyond Good and Evil related posts over on my Tumblr. And, okay, so that triangle we need, that triangle key we need a special uh, pass for that we don't have yet. But if we, yeah, there we go. Here's where we want to go. This is the empty. They don't have anything to say. Okay. There's Nori's shop. Okay. We're gonna Ming Su's shop and see if those purchasables are merely cosmetic. And if they are cosmetic, if we actually want to... I don't know, the vending machine... Identification. Okay. Sibyl, it's been digitalized. Energized Dio. I don't know if this has any advantages. Okay. A retro pro, pro oh I, I I actually like this a retro proto look for a more innocent time when Sally uh, Jade took care of lighthouse orphans okay Jade's retro outfit and what's this camera let's see what it says for this Bravo Jade vintage camera. Okay, I'm going to actually, I'm going to quit out the game. I'll, I'll get, I'll get the classic look. I'll get the classic look back, because I don't think the... Hold on, Beyond Good and Evil. Energized Dio. Beyond Good and Evil Wiki. So I'm checking. Uh, okay, so the energized Dio is act the super attack enhance. All right, the super attack enhance seems to be something different from what they call the energized Dio, which I'm reasoning to be purely cosmetic. I will. I'll check out the. So what is help and options? I want to check this how to play it settings. Okay. Bonus. What's this? Anniversary gallery. Now I'm gonna play the game. Play the game. Ah. So no, 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 no. We want to go to pedestrian district auto. That was right before. I didn't think the autosaves were frequent enough that, uh, before he blew all that cash. Alright. Alright, so around this corner. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, see? We're getting a feel for the, uh, the layout of the pedestrian district. Okay. So if we come up here, we're gonna go back in the shop. We'll just buy the retro proto look. I think, even if it's purely cosmetic, I at least feel like a different outfit for Jade back when she was known as Sally. Yeah, I feel I feel validated as a Beyond Good and Evil fan that I account identification. Okay, a box of K pops completely restored. Wait a second, energy. that has totally different things in it now. What the cheese is this? Is this... 
Oh, well, heck, there was a save point right there. Hold on. So did I... Okay, so down... So did I already buy... Okay, so I went to an autosave. All right. Okay, so I want to here. Okay. Whatever. Okay, I'll just. Oh, I like. I like this. I like this outfit a lot. This is pretty cool. No, but I feel validated as a Beyond Good and Evil enthusiast. That I reckon, uh, and we unlocked the ability to buy K buffs, which is great. A box of K buffs completely restores yeah, your I feel energy. validated as a Beyond Good and Evil fan that I recognized just from the folded up clothes that oh, this looks like some of her prototype concept art. Okay, so let's see what we've got here. Fifteen hundred. Okay, we've got to I guess validate our. Our, uh, payment card. Hello, Ming Zhu. Hello, miss. Would you like to buy something? I need to have your account number, please. Account identification. Okay. Okay, account identified. Thanks. Help yourself. It's my pleasure. Now let's give the Iris Network, uh, code words, then. Ah, so you like haikus, do you? I have an excellent collection of works, miss. Why don't you go take a look in the storeroom? I think I may have a copy left. Is 511. Okay, so. Virus 512. So these are secret uh, literature for Iris Network members. Impressive. Here we go. I keep copies of the latest I issues from the Iris Network on MDIS. If you'd like, I could also subscribe to Iris Flash. That way, you get news flashes by email. Of course, everything's free for members. I think I'll go ahead and take issues from the Iris Network. I think I'll let you help yourself. I'd like to scope the Iris Flash. Perfect, I'll sign you up right away. You're signed up. Now you'll receive the live news flashes. Alright, so basically I just subscribed to their Twitter feed, I think. Oh, press minus to read. Let's Welcome. see what let's see. You will now receive live news flashes from the Iris Network. Cool. Welcome. You will now receive live news. Alright, so I guess that other one was just a regular spam feed, and the other one was... Ah! I didn't mean to buy that, but sure. Alright, at least it makes our vehicle more uh, capable. We got a PA-1. An animal detector. A pearl. These get, things get expensive fast. Look at this. Super attack strengthen. That's two thousand for that. And what's this? A pearl detector for three k. An actual pearl. Now there is a point, and I think it's in the Neutropils Factory dungeon that we get the opportunity to purchase. Okay. Yeah, we get the opportunity to go into a room repeatedly. Hillis under fire from the Dom's meteors. The alpha sections are overwhelmed by the events. Read issue number 512 from Iris. Hillis under fire from the Dom's meteors. Okay. Yeah, the alpha se alpha sections are overwhelmed. Bravo, Yid. Active principle. We'll, if we are ever very, I'd say, let's buy the animal detector. Well done, Yeet. Detect all animals present, press minus to consult a map. Okay.
4 on map, 3 on this floor. Alright, it's certainly, I mean it's nice, but the green is maybe a little softer on the eyes. We'll see which one we end up sticking with. You know what? I might like... Oh, wow. This sky... This world sky is so beautiful. That I might end up sticking with the red outfit. Just because it makes her easier to see in dark. And there are a lot of dark, shady places. Not that I have actual trouble seeing her, but... Okay. Zoos. There's this area here. We need a special key. Okay, we need the square key now. There's a square and triangle key. We don't have either of those. So this area is just the back area here. So the only spot. Oh. We need a special key. All right. Well, I guess we'll unlock more keys as we uh further progress. So there are a number of areas we can't access past these two guards. Because we went in here, we explored an Alpha Sections facility, where we found a pearl. Nothing good for our uh, investigative reporting. But we can buy some Account identification. Okay. Yes, yeah, so we'll buy some. Yeah, I'll stock up on these. We can give. Here. Thanks. All right. So I think they. I think by giving them those, uh, they will auto heal when appropriate. We'll buy some more k bobs which are full heals, which will become a little more useful now that we have a lot more hearts as health. So if we, yeah, I think the time has come for all men and women and etc. to stand up for their planet. And in doing so, we're going to go to the, uh, the bar, back to the bar, we're going to save... And, we're g and for the first time since, since heading back to the city after completing the first dungeon, we're going to head back out into the, uh, into the greater planet and uh, start doing... Actually, we haven't gone back to... We could... Actually, let's uh, read our new uh, Iris Network episode. 800 people have disappeared from Southside. Okay. Iris 511, a new wave of kidnappings in the pedestrian district. Reporter Double H. Alright, he's the one that's gone missing, who was on an undercover mission for them. The Doms have once again struck hard at the Hillian population. Another 850 people have been reported missing since last week. Hmm. The so-called protection given by the Alpha sections against the Doms attacks is derisory at best. Derisory? I'm gonna look that up. It's a nice vocabulary word. Derisory. Ridiculously small. Inadequate. Quote, they were given a derisory pay raise. Two, another term for derisive. The derisory gaze swept over her. Alright, uh, plus, plus one vocabulary. Derisory at best. Yeah, derisory in this case uh, is probably overly generous. So we got 511. Let's check out episode issue 512. Hilly's charred with Dom's meteors. Iris 512. Hill is showered with Dom's meteors. Reporter Double H. The way Dom's is often spelled with a capital D and a capital Z. Makes me wonder if Dom's is some sort of abbreviation for something. 
Which is something I felt even back in 03. Okay. The canals, the Mamago garage, and the lighthouse shelter suffered a violent attack from the Doms yesterday. The protective shields were not able to stop the Doms meteors. The Alpha sections did not arrive on the scene until after the alert. Wow. Great job, guys. Our tax money at work. The Alpha sections are incapable of assuring the protection of Hillis. Uh, that's... I'd say even that is overly generous. Saying that they're incapable of ensuring the protection of the planet is one thing. Uh, we're pretty sure at this point that they're actively, uh, assisting the Doms in kidnapping large numbers of people as part of some sort of sinister operation. Yo. Okay, let's, let's, let's time, let's, uh, be saved. Let's head on out. Now, my, we could probably go straight to, we're going to see what it'll take to even get to the slaughterhouse, uh, not the slaughterhouse, that's later. The first, our first mission is to the, the Nutripulse factory where I think they make all the food for this area. I guess the slaughterhouse, you know what, oh, I think I figured something out. They say the, they didn't say the slaughterhouse, they say the old slaughterhouses. So I wonder if the old slaughterhouses was where they used to, like, slaughter animals to produce meat. But now the Nutripils factory is maybe where they make synthetic food without slaughtering animals. I think that, I, that's, I don't think that's ever explicitly said, but that's something I just sort of, uh, interpreted just moments ago. Um, so... So I think the way out is this way. This is the way back to our craft. Where it's docked, I guess. Alright. Yep, here we go, back in our uh, vehicle. So we don't have to... Wait. Black Isle. Okay, so these are... Factory. Okay, so that's for the factory mission. Here is... Okay, so here's our stuff. The animal detector. Alpha sections ticket. All our... Load and options. Oh! Oh! So we can load a game from here. Controls, sound, vehicles. Alright. We're I wait. So let's check out. So if we Mecha Impulsor? Okay, no, that's just pod. Alright, so those are just endemic too. With the right working parts this hovercraft. It is a central vehicle for getting the job done, even Paige would agree. Mamago. Oh! Okay. Mamago Garage put their heart and soul into this customized and colorful version of the hovercraft. Okay, we don't... We, oh, oh, okay, it's cos, it's a cosmetic... ...theming swap. Because we accidentally bought that. We didn't... I didn't want it, but... Okay. Triples the speed of your hovercraft, limited time. Info. Tri active principle. Compatible with all vehicles. Alright, because, what, did we only have two wrenches on the hovercraft before? Alright. That the way towards the hovercraft races? Yep. We can go if you wanna. We can make us some big money. All right. So that's uh, that's something we could try out later. All right. It's the right. It's Z R. No. No need for the time being. 
I'm glad it doesn't let you waste the things. Why you do- what? You said you were going into the army. God damn it. Nice advice in the... Alright, so... No, no need for... So what is... is it? Okay, so there is... Okay, so that's Black Op. The factory is down that way. We've got home. Yeah, there's the island. Slaughterhouse race. Yeah, I don't think we can get past there. Yeah, I won't even try that. That looks like it's gonna damage us. Right, so let's go over to home. Um, I guess there's a specific spot we have to go into the dock. Oh, there we go. Hangar. Wow, I can't believe we've been streaming for over an hour. I was really worried for a second. I would have to end the stream early, fortunately. I like that it docks you automatically, you don't have to line yourself up or anything crazy like that. Let's see how the kids are doing. The orphans that we take care of, all the war orphans. Anything new in the workshop? I doubt it, but it's worth taking a look. Alright. Wait. I'll try it again if it's the same message we've heard before. Then forget it. We've already, we've joined the Iris Network, so I think we've pretty solidly uh, picked a side in this fight at this point. So. Yeah, let's go back to the hangar. Ah. You know, one thing about these load times, like, if this was... Hey, the kids. The Iris Network. That's where you were trying to tell me, huh? Oh, is she like an... She's like... Whatever her species is, she appears to be slightly bioluminescent. Jade Comey Go Iris. Jade Comey Go Iris. Comey Iris. Jade Iris. Batan Matan. Hey, you got it. You're speaking our language. Keep learn me. Okay, she doesn't speak much English. Uh, me sona ala. Uh, okay. The Toki Sina. Okay. Me, hey Jade, you're not gonna believe me. But I saw Wolf walking around with your camera in his mouth again. My camera? I swear. Huh. got him. Is this the shield? Shield activated. Shield disabled. That's a nice touch that you can do that. So what is this a switch for? So I'm guessing that's where he came out of. Let's see. What do you have to say? Hello, Pablo. 
Hey, Jade, you're not gonna... Okay, we talked to him already. Wait a second. Alright, looks like we use an old piece of Alpha Section scrap metal to, for the floor here. Okay. Here's the goat kid. Hey, Finn. Who are you, stranger, that dare speak to Fen the Fantastic? Please forgive me, Mobile Knight. It is but I, Jade. Good morrow to you, damsel. Alright. Cute kid doing this. He's the kid. This is the kid that we were, te we were meditating with earlier. Huh. Okay, three, three. I wonder if these refresh after each dungeon or something similar to that. That looks like our home heating source. Okay, no, that's the way back out. You know, that's funny, this doesn't have an actual door, technically. You never, I don't, did you ever climb to the top of the lighthouse? I mean, I've been a reason to at that point. Okay, so there's that area. Scooting. Oh, what? Good okay. thing we got the alpha sections to protect us. Be brave. Yeah. We've got to stay strong. Yeah, no point in uh, red pilling all these kids. Good, but I think I'm going to have to leave the White House for a while. Don't worry, I'll take care of everything here. Thanks, Omi. Alright, so there are a few... No, I'm not really hungry right now. Why does there... It's... Yeah. There seems to be a particularly high abundance of goat people in this lighthouse. Of all, among these, the child population here. Oh. Okay. Mago, 12 plus 67 equals 79. I'll try... Oh, those look like the blueprints for his boots. His uh, jet boots. So let's try this. 1, 2, 6, 7. Maybe. Alright, that was a... Uh, red herring. Alright, we'll uh, leave that alone for now. Hey, it's the... Hey, it's the doggo. Excuse me, camera. I'm going a little bananas there. Alright. There we go. Can't play now, okay? Oh. No, woof, no! Uh, that's a pretty... Instead of it, he had our camera, that was a box of K-Bops, not a camera. Alright. Oh, I got some low resolution photos of me, it looks like. Okay. Oh, cool. That, that, now, this is some nice world building. It looks like Jade, in addition to the digital element where she could instantly send the photos, it looks like there's like an actual traditional chemistry photography thing going on. Uh, when I was in college... Was that a fourth wall breaking... Okay, who's, what's this kid doing? Okay, that's only. Alright. Alright, that's... Okay, we talked to him. Alright. So 
So is there anything else in this lighthouse? Okay, there's... Up there's the photo lab. Okay, this is... Oh, it's the uh, washroom. Hey, PA-1. Nice. Okay, I keep for you. Okay. We're getting a lot of hearts pretty fast. In fact... No, I'm not really hungry right now. I'm gonna give one of these... Just one. We're gonna give to... Oh, or... So how do I... I did... I've done it before. Open. Wait, so I can take... I'm trying to figure out this interface. I swear this did not give me... This... Okay. So if I... Oh, you know what? I'm not close. I'm not close enough to Paige. He has to actually be physically adjacent to me for me to exchange items off him. Okay, I get it now. I get it. I get it. It's, it's realistic. I, I okay. I, I understand. Hi Zaza. Hi Jade. Feeling better? Having fewer nightmares? A little fewer. Hang in there, Zaza. Aww. K-Bobs for our trouble. Alright. Wow, the moon is huge in our sky. But it looks like we... Man, these kids... Okay, these kids just teleport around based on where we're at on the island. Okay, I get it. I get it. This way. Wait, did I take a picture of the dog yet? Hey, we didn't take a picture of the dog. Dog on the stupid interface. Superb specimen. I'll file it. I wish she said, "Oh, look at the doggy." That would have been cute. Okay, so now I say it's time. maybe consider uh, heading on over to the to the warehouse I don't know like I made some choices about what to eat earlier not uh, honestly I'm feeling like I might get sick again okay I'm gonna use the disc reader and call it a stream because I feel way too sick I can't keep going Oh, I can't keep going like this. Okay. No, it was in the workshop. That's where I could save that. And just a disclaimer, at any moment I may have to run off camera. swallowing. Oh my gosh. I have to go off camera for a moment.
All right, I forgot to mute the mic, so I hope none of you had to hear that. Ugh. All right. Okay. Yeah, I think that uh, qualifies for uh, an end of stream right there. Yeah, I did actually get sick. Uh, and you know, last time I came 95% of the way to getting sick on stream, this time I came 100% of the way of getting sick on stream. I mean, not in terms of on camera, but I did um, have to run to the bathroom in my apartment. Fortunately, I have a small apartment, and my bathroom is right next to my streaming setup. But, uh, I think that's going to uh, mark the end of today's stream. I'm waiting for our end screen to pop up. There we go. Yeah, so that'll do it for today's stream. Uh, I'll be back on the 31st. Unfortunately, I will be gone uh, this coming weekend. I will be uh, out of town attending some uh, business, some uh, some business relating to my uh, writing career. And but I will be back uh, on Saturday the 31st. We'll play more Beyond Good and Evil. We'll head to the factory, hopefully complete my goal for our next Beyond Good and Evil stream, which is our next stream. We will. I, my goal is to reach and complete the factory. It's a little ambitious. We'll see. And with a little Pac-Man as a warm-up. I'm going to reduce the the warm-up section. It was 15 minutes today. I'm going to reduce it down to just 10 minutes. Because an extra 5 minutes. It, around the 10-minute mark of, you know, 10 minutes of... Uh, when I got to 5 minutes left in the warm-up period, my just chatting period, that is, happens to be the same point where I felt, you know, it's getting a little long in the tooth. But I already had the timer on screen, so I wanted to uh, hold true to that. But... Uh, let me take a look at what's going on on, uh... Yeah, there's really, uh... No one I'm, uh, close pals with that's on right now, so I'm just gonna go ahead and end the stream right there. So I will see you all next time, and thank you very much for watching. <laughs>